It's currently 7.30 in the morning. So ladies and gentlemen, that is my ride to work. It is currently 8 o'clock. I feel when you wake up early, you go to bed early, you're more productive. And a lot of people disagree and say, well, I don't like getting up until like 10 in the morning, going to work at like 2 in the afternoon. What up guys, just got off work and it is 88 degrees. I'm about to go get some ice cream because I do have kind of a sore throat uh, coming on and I know it's because last night it was literally like 80 degrees at 11 o'clock at night with almost 96 percent humidity So now we're about to head into uh, Cold Stone, which is a ice cream place, so I can get uh, some ice cream. So that's how you devour ice cream and my mouth is still dry and I know it's because of the hot humid heat that we have here in Florida because uh, every other place I've ever lived that is not extremely hot or humid I've never dealt with like this random dry, uh, dry mouth all the time. And you can't say, well, you're not drinking enough water. What? I drink this bad boy all day at work. This whole damn thing is a gallon of water. I drink that all the time. We are gonna um, head home. Hey, what's up, guys? Yes, it is four. 59 in the morning to be completely honest with you i couldn't even go to sleep i went to bed and i just been laying in bed all night probably because i took a nap earlier in the day so what is weird is normally it takes me four to five minutes to fall asleep and then i go to bed at like 11 get up at 6 make breakfast i'm out the door by 7 30 at work by 8 but the last time i went to bed was wednesday and i got four hours of sleep yeah i came home at one o'clock, went took a nap from one to about 5.30, and that's the last time I uh, slept. So I don't know if that nap really messed my sleep schedule up because right now I'm not even tired. I guarantee you when I get, to, when I get off work today, I'm gonna be tired-ish. You know what is crazy? <clears throat> like I said, I got no sleep whatsoever. The only thing is, I'm hungrier than a mother pecker. So we're on the way to get something to eat.
we are stuck on the Matthews Bridge trying to go and get lunch. Like, I thought actually to take the other bridge, to be honest, but this bridge uh, has an accident. That's why the oncoming traffic lane is empty. I don't know if you guys can see that. That's crazy backed up. I'm telling you guys, if you live in the city that I live in, in Jacksonville, Florida, there's a lot of accidents and a lot of them happen on the bridges and when they happen on the bridges all lanes get shut down and backed up there's uh seven bridges and there's accidents like that all the time <clears throat> i will say this is a nice area to eat go round the loop de loo we're pulling up to get my food this place is nice like this area they kind of make it look kind of european-ish hopefully i can find some parking because uh i need to get my parking on hopefully it ain't all oh okay good boy back your shit up so i can park but yeah this place is nice That's our version of Big Ben. Ha ha. Remember to rate, even if you hate, comment, and subscribe. And if you see right here, that's why my cat scratched me up earlier today. Ha ha. But anyways, as you could probably tell, my voice is getting a little bit raspy because I am getting a little bit of sore throat. I did find some medicine that I had from the last time I was sick. I'm going to start taking that. And um, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this little video. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.